Hi, I'm Artem from ATEX Studios, and I'm here to show you how to use the dangerous speaker management system here in Studio C by using the remote. The remote is located to the left of the desk monitor and allows you to control the speakers and how you listen through them. Main means that you're listening through the Genelec speakers. Alt-1 means that you're listening to the Focals. You can also have control of muting individual speakers with this panel right here. And the speaker lights up red when it is muted. And you also have total volume control with this knob right here. Now, if you want to have 5.1, you need to switch from analog input one to analog input four. And you also need to do a little bit of patching along with that. By default, Pro Tools outputs one and two are normaled to dangerous in one. So there is no patching necessary there. However, if you would like to patch in the guest panel, for instance, you would patch in from the guest panel to dangerous in one. By default, the Blu-ray outputs are patched into Dangerous in 4. However, if you wish to use Pro Tools in 5.1 in Studio C, you need to patch in DAW out 1 through 6 into Dangerous In's left through LFE. Once Pro Tools 1 through 6 are patched into the Dangerous In 4, you should have 5.1 output as long as you switch to input 4 on the Dangerous Remote and your actual Pro Tools session is set up to output in 5.1. To do this, you simply go to your IOs and make sure that left, right, left, surround, right, surround, center, and LFE in that order are the selected outputs and that your track has 5.1 as the output. I hope that brief video helps explain how to route outputs in Studio C for 5.1 and stereo through the dangerous remotes. Thank you all for watching.